Alright guys, welcome back for some more Bloodstained Curse of the Moon 2. Let's finish level 6. The level I hate the most. Now everybody has an attack upgrade. So now the upgrade is the last item is this way. Whee! Whoa! <laughs> Get out. Down, I see. And there's the last upgrade. Nothing left to do now, but to just finish the level. And we have all these characters too. I'll take that. We're going to just go, go, go. Of course, that has my most hated boss. We're just going to take the speediest of ways. There we go. We know how to handle them. Shoot them. Boom. It recommends us to go this way, and that's just what I'm doing.
Alright. I'm gonna try and keep all my weapon points. Because we're going to try and get Alfred in there. And use those orbs. And completely annihilate the boss. As you notice, we didn't have to worry about this room at all. But I am going to try and keep everyone topped up in here. Alright. Alright. Let's see how easy this becomes with the orbs. We have four chances of using it. <laughs> Once you have the orbs, that's it. All right. We now have everything. We have everything now. Nothing left to do but to start the level. Yep. And, uh, <laughs> totally surprised on what the next level is like. We are playing... A shoot 'em up Yep. We are playing a shoot 'em up to get there. So we got, that's the speed up, I will grab that. It plays just like Gradius, or Life Force, whatever you know. I'm not going to grab too much speeds because I don't want to move too fast, because wall collision is a thing in this. You don't want to crash into things. That's all I'm grabbing. Alright, we have Alfred Spears, uh, Robert Spears. The weapons we get on the ship does not reflect what they have. That's a bomb. We have Miriam Sights, which come back. Oh, no. I gotta be careful not to get killed. That's a shield, basically. Alfred's fire. Also, really good music. All right, here's one of those collision things. Don't touch the asteroids. Dominique's things, and we have Zengetsu's talisman. Ah, I prefer the spears. These basically act like options. Jeebles bats. Ah, Hachi's arm. We punch anything if it gets too close. Sights just totally confuse me sometimes. Uh, oh shoot, I did not. Oh, damn it, it's at me. I need speed up. All 
I need speed up. The bones. I'll take that. Oh, I'm moving too slow. Damn it. You die once, you're hindered. I, I need some upgrades now. Options, not bad. No, I don't need speed. OG, OG. Ugh! Give me that speed, give me that speed. I usually play better on this level than I give myself. Uh, his Oni power. Gives him just twin cannons. No. Stop guarding the speed ups. I'll take that. Oh, I didn't mean that. No, I want that. I want that. Alright, now we got a canny canyon. No, I don't want the fire spell. Miriam's blades are okay to have. There's no more collision, so I don't feel bad for having extra speed ups. Ah, oh, sheesh. Another option, I'm okay with that. I prefer, yeah. Uh, his tap. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, I can handle that. Oh, Hachi's arm. Uh, boss time. We do have a boss. Uh. Oh. Oh, really? I didn't know that was a thing. So what, he's just going to keep doing that? Oh my god, that was my last life with this. Our lives here do not matter in the uh, on-foot stages. Oh man, I played terrible. Alright. Well now we're on the moon. The moon's lament. And we keep our stuff, thankfully. Alright guys, this is the final level. Join us next time when we potentially finish Bloodstained Curse of the Moon 2 once and for all. With that said, Bloodstained Curse of the Moon 2 potentially to be concluded.